just incredible. Two, two. DJ Sour Mill. One, one. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Power 106. Yeah. Oh, it's go time, man. Just incredible. Sour milk. Ski mask, the slump guy. You dig? Is in here. <laughs> All good vibes, bro. Hey, welcome hey, to the show, man. Back at it again, Welcome, boys. welcome, <laughs> welcome. Back at it again. <laughs> What's the deal, man? Happy belated birthday. Always a pleasure. Birthday. Always a pleasure. How Yo, was, thank you. Thank how was you. the uh, birthday turn up? It was definitely fire. You know, went skiing, ski, went skiing, ski, mm. had to go skiing. Hey, that's <laughs> Wait, right. is that like a normal thing for you? Like Hell no. The, okay, so this this was, this was the, how, how did the nope. experience go? Busted my ass. <laughs> bro, I left that, that shit. Me, I left that shit with an ass full of snow, nigga. I swear to God, I fell. I fell so many times and there was just snow in my ass. Like, dog. And, and what made you uh, pick skiing over snowboarding? Um... Just because it, it, I just the name to try. is it the yeah. name or, it was or? The, I wanted to try skiing because okay. because <laughs> the name basically <laughs> this nigga Gabe my my DJ he uh, snowboarded and he was just going crazy though I don't think it's harder they say it's harder than skiing what? snowboarding's harder they say snowboarding's harder than skiing but like it didn't mm. look that way to me bro hmm. it looks I'd, like, I'd bust my ass on either for yeah, you sure, feel me bro that's not so for sure I just. Hey man, meet me at the bottom of the mountain. Best way to explain it is like, um, you ever skateboarded down a hill? No, I can't, can't say I've done that either. <laughs> we're, not, we're not risk takers over here, yeah. bro. <laughs> yeah, listen, bro. I fucking smoked weed twice in my life. I mean, you know, maybe, what I mean? maybe rode a bike once or twice down a hill, but that's that's about it. You feel no, me? I, I, no. I listen. The, the craziest I get is is I don't use condoms. Um, All right, so, you're a different breed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we we don't. We, you know, we, we don't. We don't use condoms out here, bro. You with that campaign? <laughs> yeah. You oh, know, no, what I'm push that one. I can't push. <laughs> Kids, you can't. Up. You can't co sign that one. <laughs> I can't. Man, scrap up, kids. Uh, what was the best, or what does someone get ski mask for his birthday? What's, what's the birthday gifts look like? Hennessy. <laughs> That's okay. good to know. Yeah, Next that, time we're going to have it on deck. Dog. We, we, nah, need that, we need that hen up here, man. Um, was there, was there any gifts that, that, gift? that stood out to you this year where you were like, oh, shit, you got me. I really wanted this. You know what? I don't think people even expect to buy me anything anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, that's, that's what I was gonna say. Like, what do you buy people that that, that, that could really buy whatever the fuck they want? Yeah, so right. It was just the more of the fact that just being pe- being with people, like their presence and shit. Um, somebody bought me a gift that was like a knife that opened a champagne bottle. Hmm. I feel like I mean the knife. Can you, like can you the, open Henny with it? It was just a knife. That opens a champagne bottle. Yeah, it was just a knife. But, hey, look, it was I, a gift. Like, it's the thought that counts. <laughs> it is is uh, it the thought that counts? I don't know, but, hey, look. <laughs> she could have <laughs> thought harder. No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Oh, let's, talk, let's talk about the music, man. Stoke Lee, the album dropped uh, yes, last year, man. A lot yes, of hot joints on there that we playing on the radio and Thank in the club you, sets. Thank I appreciate course. it. Um, sophomore album on the way, or what, what? what's in the works? Um, All right, so what I'm working on right now is I got an EP in the works. Okay. I'm gonna do a short, short project of something with trying to um almost almost got her, but I'm get trying to get Lauren Hill on it. Oh, sick! Okay, um, I have hard. Chance the Rapper, mm, so nice. I'm gonna try to go in that vibe of a short, just a short project and like really meaningful, meaningful, genuine music. You know what I mean? Stuff that catches on like deeply. And mm. then right after that, I'm gonna get back to like my fuck shit, like what I love <laughs> to do. So right now, oh. And in the midst of all that, I'm working on Evil Twins with Juice World. Okay, that's 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 exciting. Yeah, man. we, we definitely exciting. wanted to touch on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We definitely yeah. wanted. What, to what touch can you on tell that. us about? Because we we you know you, that that's confirmed now. I mean, I thought I heard the rumors and stuff like yeah, that, yeah, but yeah. what what can? Well, there's two questions to that because first of all, can, he won the Billboard Award tonight, man. We're yeah, mad, go crazy, my yeah. guy just went mad fucking, excited. What yeah. what's so special about Juice World as an artist to you, man? What can you say about the homie? Oh man, Juice World. Yo, he's just you just can't count Juice World out. It's just like um I go and I hang out with him and shit and then to to see how he works, bro, it's just like damn, bro, you really like you really deserve everything that Juice World has. True, he man. really does cuz like if you see him freestyle, it's just abnormal, fam. Dude, it's bro. so weird how he puts things together and just like off like for the longest time. I was going to say, he doesn't stop. He Never. doesn't. No. Unless you stop him. Yeah. <laughs> he, uh, he he freestyled on our show, but also, too, I know he said he like basically freestyled his album. Right. And I'm like, fuck, bro. Like, yeah. the, the album's amazing. And <laughs> yeah, he does. it just goes to show, like, it's sky's crazy, the limit for the right? homie, man. Does, does that put pressure on you when you're in there recording with him and he's just, like, freestyling shit? And you're like... <laughs> nah, honestly, like, because we, we both respect each other equally as artists. We both know, like, what our specialties are. Mm-hmm. I'm more of a written 
writing like type of guy, I write the fuck out of some shit. Yeah. And, he, and he knows that. Yeah. But the way that I write, I feel like I can put stuff together differently than uh-huh. how he uh how he does it. You yeah, 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 yeah. See, that's different for us. To put it in perspective, we both DJ and when milk starts scratching and then <laughs> yeah. I have to get on, it's like <laughs> fuck <laughs> my set. Like what am I supposed to do? <laughs> like, you know? Know? Yeah. But it, uh that. what is it? Steel sharp and steel, man. You know, it's like you get in there with the homies and your family, yeah. Yeah, make each other better. And then always like um yeah, good competition. Always and and good competition for, for those, uh, you know what I'm saying, that aren't too familiar with your work, because honestly, I feel like I was late uh, yeah. on, on, on mm. the train. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I, I think the first, obviously I had heard your name, and then the first um, like snippet I had heard what was the... Tell me how late I am. Was was the Boy Meets World sample? Oh wow! That wow. that like when you put that snippet up, and I was like, oh shit! I you was know, like in New York around that time. Yeah, I was like, this dude could fucking rap. <laughs> like he could, he could you rap. Know what it was about that song too. I was gonna get Busta on that song. Ooh. That's when I just around the time met Busta Rhymes, and I was gonna get him on that song. The boy, um, Boy Meets World. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was, so so yeah. So so that like I said, that was that was my introduction to you. Yeah. Um. But what can you tell people, you know, for those that might not be familiar w- with your work, um, is there, I don't even want to say who would you compare yourself to, but mm-hmm. but what would you say that, that your work is like? What would you recommend people listen to first mm. for, for those who haven't heard your work? Oh, Should they start at the beginning or is there, or is there something? Nah, you, know? you have to go to the back. I think you should start. Yeah, you should definitely start at the beginning. You have to listen to what where me and X started because I. I really started off music with Jose, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? And yes. then it just really just drifted off into something way more beautiful. So to put it all into like perspective, I would say that I'm a really, I used to listen to like a lot of Wu-Tang Clan, mm-hmm. a lot of Busta Rhymes, um, mm-hmm. Miss Elliott. Yeah. Miss Elliott's definitely fire. Um, Twista even, I get a little Twista in there. Um... Who else? What was it? Was it uh, only rap, or did you listen to like other genres? I was stuff? listening to other genres too. Like I was listening to Erica Badu back then too. Like, oh. um, of course, Lauren Hill back then. Yeah. The Fugees. Yeah. Uh, fucking Andre 3000. Mm-hmm. I love Andre 3000. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, I, I feel like everybody in the world has an Andre 3000 photo except for me. Really? I don't know. Neither. Yeah. Like, I, don't know. I, I feel like motherfuckers <laughs> see him randomly. Like, oh yeah, I ran into Andre at like Sweet Chick or something. <laughs> right. It's like. Like, yeah, what the fuck? Damn. That's crazy as fuck. You know what I need to meet him. Yeah, the person real. I met like that was um, uh, Charlotte Gambino. Okay. I seen him on the airplane, and he was looking like the smoothest <laughs> motherfucker alive, bro. He had, like, Did you say what up to him? Or? I did it. I did it. I didn't know what to say to him because he looked so cool. He was just standing there by himself, had his little straw hat, like a little shirt open with the fucking chest hair. I was just like, yeah. I'm going to leave him alone. Is, is, it, is it one of those things to where you're like, fuck, like, what if I, I don't want to say what's up to him and he doesn't know who I yeah, am? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's weird. So it's just like, I fuck with you. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, for real. How many tattoos do you have, bro? Ah, oh, man. I got a lot, but I got mainly, the most of them is like on my face, mm. on my neck, right, right here. It, it really started off with me and Jose going, <laughs> G-shit. Because he would battling? get one, I would get one. Like, yeah. Yeah. But um, it was really like a, a meaning of to tell myself that this is my only job. Like, I have to make it. You, you know had I mean? no choice. I had no choice. So I had no job at the time. My first one was the cross. I had no job at the time, and it was just basically to tell myself, like, yeah, this is it. No turning back. No turning back, yeah. (sighs) I felt like I was, and then plus I was like, um, if a job wouldn't want me for something that's on my face, I wouldn't want the job anyways, you know what I mean? That's true. Okay. What what, what did your your people think about that? Like, when you decided to take up rap as a career? My parents? Oh, yeah, yeah, they did not fuck with me at that time. (laughs) 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 They was not fucking with it. They was like, what? What's going on? School, school, school. And then, and then once it finally started, you know, they still was like, once it started even drifting off into something good, they still was like, so, so what about school? Like, I'm like, do you not see what's going on? Right here, son? I do plan on finishing school at some point, but 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 now that they, they they support it or definitely still... supportive, yeah, definitely okay. way more supportive and understanding and stuff. I guess they seen the route of what it had to take. I guess, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah, okay. Now with uh, members only, volume three dropped back in like 2017. Mm-hmm. Uh, is there plans for a uh, volume four? You know, I, w- I could only hope. Yeah. Um, I know there's definitely way more music coming from um, Jose's side. Um, I know Members Only, it's if Members Only chooses to, like, uh, come together and make, I think they're all working on their own thing right now, yeah, okay. like their own single um, projects. 
as for now, but you know, there's never like there's always time for yeah members only one. For that, that's that's exciting moments, man. Yeah, definitely. Also, the the Revenge of the Dreamers, man. I mean, mm-hmm. we seen you in the sessions. Yeah, we, couple, we heard the snippet. Yeah, cut your snippet. You know, it was <laughs> crazy, bro. I never met J Cole before, and I was there like the whole time. Yeah. What, what what was your first interaction with him like? Oh, with J- I never you, met no, no, J Cole. No, 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 with J Cole. Oh, oh, you didn't even in the, in the there. session. Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought you. But we was in the same building the whole time. It's just so many people. Like they had so many people. There's so many producers. They had Kenny, Wonder Girl. They had so many good. So you just producers. kind of bouncing from session to session. We mm-hmm. heard you went in there and gassed though, bro. I did. That. We heard. We heard you. <laughs> went in there. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I ain't even gonna lie to you, fam. I went in there and I gassed shit. Hell so yeah. what's the mindset like going in? Is it like that? Like, yo, there's a lot of my peers here. I gotta make sure I make a fucking track. Yeah. That it, it was lap. all. All right. <laughs> this is my first time being around um, Dreamville. So okay. I'm there and I was like, I definitely can't make a bad impression. You know what Hell I mean? Not. So I was just like every, but it's like a group full of. Like, uh, this this m- amount of people just watching you, like, and the room's quiet. The beat's playing. Everybody already snapped. So I'm like, oh yeah, I'm not going out like no bitch. I was like, hell no, I ain't going out like no bitch. Um, it, w- it, was that like the most nerve wracking sessions that you've had? It was, yeah, because there's so many people watching you. But That's it was pressure. also one of the most. Uh, it's always it's always it was fun, right? It's always fulfilling. Yeah, yeah. Once, once you do like like hit that hit what you did want to do mm-hmm. you know what i mean yeah mm-hmm. damn that's crazy man and then and then once i mean like i said the, the 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 little snippet video that you put out it looked like i got too much skills i feel like the water the <laughs> yo yeah. motherfuckers were in there going crazy with that shit yeah, like that what shit what's what's that feeling like it was to see energy. your peers it was yeah like nah. react like that that shit's you know amazing saying? bro there's nothing there's no better feeling than um people that you care about or yeah. that, that you respect um, appreciates or fucks with what right. you're doing. You know what I mean? There's no right. better feeling than that. Right. That's yeah. what's up, man. That's, you care about that more than like uh, like anybody else's yeah. opinion. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, Be- me, Being man. a past uh, XXL freshman, who do you think deserves to be on this new class? Is there is there anybody that stands out to you? I know I'm putting you on the spot right now. No, 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 no. I know the list. That's why I'm looking. I'm oh, like, you already I, know the... Uh, I can't tell you. Oh! I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I mean, you know, I we, mean, we are the LA leakers, bro. Oh, shit. Come on, dog. I can't do it, dog. I can't do it. I, I mean, bro, we it. always been honest with you. I can't Come do on, it. be honest I know, with us. I'll tell you, Scheme, Scheme is the um, DJing for it. Okay. He's DJing for it. He's playing the beats for the uh, Oh, that's the rappers. it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and so who's he I'll playing beats after. for? Who's he playing beats I'll for? Like, what rappers, what rappers is he yeah, playing like, beats for? Uh, wow. Um, I'll tell y'all after, though. <laughs> For real, for real. All right. no, hey, All right. don't I don't want to spoil the surprise. Don't or the cameras. Yeah, keep everything rolling. All right, we're done. Thank you for coming by. Yeah. So who, who's on it, though? We ain't going to tell nobody. Just, no, just between us, bro, for real. Not just between us. No, no, just chill. I can't do it to him. I can't do it to him. That's love, man. That's, That's love. love. All right, be before, we, before you bounce, man, we're going to... Put you, put you in a round of just in time, man. Basically, we're going to ask you uh, as many questions as we can in 60 Uh-oh. seconds. Okay, let's get it. All right. Um, Wait, do I need the stop clock? Do yeah, can, can you put the stop clock on too for Too much us? skills. I feel go. like the water so uh, surprised I did not grow gills. And tell- I am your father like you as Luke Skywalker. And I concur and let it burn like Usher's perm and kill confirm. You look concerned. Respect this urn. Oh, mm. You really? You oh, we, really <laughs> we weren't even talking about rapping, but but shit. Go ahead. Keep, yeah, yeah rap as many lines as you can in 60 seconds. Hold on, hold on. Tell me when to start. You get two packs. Passes. Yeah. All right. Anything after that, you got to donate a hundred dollars to a charity of our choice. Okay. We cool. didn't agree upon that before <laughs> yeah. this, but I'm just putting you on the spot. That's but he it. said, "Fuck it." I we're, fuck yeah, it. Fuck with you, I mean, we, oh, we're just it, kidding it, about the hundred dollars. But if you're with it, we'll take the hundred dollars. I'm all for donating the charities, man. <laughs> well, the, no, the charities is actually our pockets, is what, what <laughs> our, our shoe collection. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are. We're still a work in progress. It's a work in progress. Are we ready? Ready. All right. Start the clock, Mo. Go. All right. Ski mask. What's your favorite food? Oxtail. Who would you rather? <laughs> Would you rather forget your phone or your wallet at home? Phone. Salty or sweet foods? Salty. Dark or clear liquor? I think we know the answer. Dark. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite place to listen to music? Home. Backwoods <laughs> or papers? Definitely papers. Mosh pits or crowd surfing? Mosh pits. If you weren't doing what you're doing now in music, what would you be doing? <sighs> NASCAR. Nice. What's the last thing you bought? Cigarettes. Mm. What's your pre-show <laughs> ritual? Uh, thinking about Jesse. Okay. Favorite song to perform? Take a step back. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite movie? 
Gotta be the end game now. It gotta be. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. It has to. Finish this sentence. I hate it when. Hmm. Mm. Time's up. Fuck. Oh. oh. Was that the last one too? The last one. Fuck. <laughs> you almost made it, man. Yeah. Almost made it. Appreciate you, brother. Hell yeah, bro. Thank you for your energy. Thank you guys for you, bro. More yeah, success. Hey, 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 I'm coming back drunk next time and I'll rap next time. Penny. We get a <laughs> Penny sure. popping. For sure. For sure. Yeah. We're going to go crazy. I got you for sure next Thank time, you, bro. bro. Congrats yeah. on the project. We look forward to more new music from you. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you always got a home with the LA Leakers, brother. Yes, sir. Appreciate, I appreciate you. you guys. Thank yes, you, man. Sir. Power 106. Hey, 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 hey.